When the days grow shorter, it's always a process for me to find my creative footing again. While the sensations of autumn still inspire me, I am struck every year by the swift fading of color and light. It's true that we're connected with nature, so if the earth is getting ready for sleep, why am I still struggling to rest? I think it lies in the simple act of finding balance. Only then can we rest. And each day, I find it easier to surrender and rise in the morning renewed. On those days when I feel stuck on a project or an idea, I try to turn my attention elsewhere. I choose to work with my hands, I explore the senses, and nourish myself with vibrant plant medicine. Even doing something as simple as blending my own tea can feel like an inspiring act of magic. In turn, when I nourish myself, I find that I'm inspired by old and forgotten ideas. Like the seasons, there is a time for vibrant activity. And likewise, there's always a time to rest. There will always be many paths, and the choice remains with us. When I choose to trust my path, I find that I am pleasantly surprised at times. I brought out with me notes from an old story draft from about five years ago. Funnily enough, I found an old journal dating the same year. I flipped to a random page. I feel happy, confident, loved, and inspired. I remember writing that, and I know that those feelings are always within my grasp. What do you do to remain inspired during the darker months? A huge thank you to everyone who has been following along and subscribing. Your support is so appreciated.